so dmd curriculum was very good and at that time i felt a need to learn more of anesthesia so i joined conceptual anesthesia in september 2023 actually and after that you, you saw me i got the rank of 29 and uh, my i actually passed the mb with also flying colors so yeah it was my journey so actually what happened uh, in september 2023 we had our practicals for fat like uh, kind of uh, an assessment test which we used to go outside from the hospital and we used to give the test over there so i was miserable in that test so then i thought ki i need to do something now because it has been around 1.5 years of my residency has been over but i need to uh, pick up the things now because and at that time so only conceptual anesthesia app was there which was telling us to read from chalk and board kind of thing the janvi ma'am was there and she was teaching from uh, chalk and board it was not slides like slides were not reading uh, she was not reading slides and all so i subscribed just because of that and i actually inquired before subscribing that uh, whether ma'am is teaching from chalk and board or it was she was just reading the slides so they thought they told me that the ma'am is teaching from the slide itself or oh, this thing chalk and board itself thank you and i subscribed from conceptual anesthesia and so duty hours were very hectic at that time because we were in second year and we used to go by 8:30 and we used to come by 8:30 in the evening then after coming back i started by bits and pieces like uh, seeing half a lecture at a time then next day i was completing the lecture so the journey started from that and i actually completed some 80% of the lectures by may or june 2024 and after that i started my preparation for dnb and my hod was really helpful at that time and uh, he they he gave us the holidays for two two months around before the studies so we, i actually paced up the things from in the last two months and uh, so after that i studied for practicals dnb and after practicals dnb after just one month we had the exam so after finishing the practicals i just solved mcqs from the conceptual anesthesia app and one more book was there and but the questions were almost similar so after the solving the exams uh, solving the uh, mcqs the exam got clear sir so oh, that is great 